welcome to the KitchenAid kitchen. The KitchenAid stand mixers come in two variants, the tilt head and the bowl lift models. I have three of the bowl lift models right here. Now when we compare the bowl lift to the tilt head, the difference is in a tilt head the head of the motor tilts back whereas in a bowl lift we have a lever which is used to lower the bowl and fix it back in place. This is the 5 quart or 4.8 litre capacity, a 300 watt motor, it has speeds ranging from 1 to 10. It's an all metal construction with all metal gears, very robust and stable. The attachment hub is common to all, so all the KitchenAid attachments can be used on this as well. We have a stainless steel bowl and the three standard accessories, the wire whisk, the tow hook and the flat beater. It also has a pouring shield which has a dual purpose. When you're mixing dry flour or other dry ingredients, it doesn't fly out. Also, the pouring shield allows you to pour in liquids while it's mixing. Now, when we talk about the 5 quart bowl lift model and the 5 quart tilt head, even though it's the same capacity but because of the suspended bowl design, it allows you an additional 2 cup capacity as it's able to handle more torque particularly for bread making. Hence, we recommend you use it in a household where there is a lot of bread making or there's heavy usage of this particular model. We can move on to the next which is our professional model which is a 6.9 litres or 7 quart bowl. It again comes with three standard accessories. The wire whisk, but here it's an 11 wire whisk. We have the flat beater and a dough hook. It comes with a pouring chute which is removable and you can fix it back onto the wire cage. It has an emergency switch as well as a wire guard which act as a safety measure. Uh, it's ideal to use in commercial kitchens. When we talk about the power of the machine, it has a 1.3 horsepower motor which is extremely robust and durable. When we compare the professional model to the heavy duty model, they both are exactly the same power which is 1.3 horsepower. The bowl capacity is 6.9 litres which is 7 quarts. We have the three standard accessories, the wire whip, the flat beater and the dough hook. In case of the heavy duty, the flat beater and the dough hook are nylon coated whereas in the professional they are not. Uh, it lowers and fits back into place like all other models of the bowl lift. The attachment hub on the professional and heavy duty models also have an additional groove on the inside which allow you to use the new range of attachments which are viable for commercial use and can be used on all models 7 quarts and above. We also have the pouring shield which has a dual purpose. It contains the flour in the bowl and doesn't let it fly. Also you can add in liquids while mixing. We're going to use the professional model to make dough uh, as it can handle a lot of torque. We have all our ingredients for our dough in the bowl. We're going to fix it back into place, lower down the cage. The cage also acts as a safety feature. When it's not in place, you will not be able to turn on the machine. So it has to be in its place to be able to switch it on. We recommend for dough making to use the stand mixer at speed 6. The power needs spiral dough hook is the most effective for any kind of bread dough. The KitchenAid bowl lift stand mixers make heavy duty mixing in larger quantities a breeze. 